All right, we're back. Continue this human tourist run here. So the big issue right now that I remember we're dealing with is there's a Titan. So there's a Titan in the Medusa level who is hostile. So um, we don't really have a good way to deal with it. So I think I have to figure out I'm wondering if I have a wand of digging back in my stash, because that would really help out. It's sort of my, in my uh, bag here. A couple of scrolls of enchant weapon. We can get Molnir up to plus seven, possibly. Extra healing, maybe for some max HP. Probably gonna pick, some, pick up some more. I think I left a bunch of stuff back at the stash. Um, really laggy right now. I don't know why. Kind of strange. Huh. Well, that's really odd. Okay. That's uh, a little better now. Hopefully, I don't end up with a bunch of lag here. And I have my towel on here just because I did remember that I had some dragons here. So if I wanted to get some dragon scale mail, I could potentially uh, fight these things. The issue is going to be that these blue dragons in particular, they're immune to the extra damage from Molnir, uh, so they're gonna be really hard to kill. I see it's pretty decent. My hit points are not great, but, but okay. I had a scroll of, of scare monster or something, I'd feel better about it. Although the bugle will work. And do I have a... I do not have a scroll of enchant armor. I, need, I think I have to go back to my stash, unfortunately. We're going to spend a little time uh, getting back there. Um, you know, the really weird thing is it's like updating on my... Twitch Studio preview before it's updating on my screen, which is very strange. It's just a nurse, okay. Could do some nurse dancing. Um, all right, here's a gigantic general store. Let me just double check. See if I left anything here of interest. And my invisibility ring is off. I should put that back on. Potentially a decent ring. I think I was gonna come back with money. There's two scrolls here which are really interested I'm really interested in. So um but that was the other thing. I think I left some gems back in my stash and um yeah this is, i'm looking at my preview screen my twitch studio preview screen and my character has moved but then i'm looking at my terminal window they haven't so uh, my terminal is not updating <laughs> but somehow it's updating on my on my um twitch studio so let me see if i can fix that I did make a change to my monitor, which I'm wondering if maybe it did something. And then I might just um, just relaunch this terminal as well, because I did have some issues. Let's see, save. Um... Oops, and I'm just changing my changing my uh, settings here randomly. 
All right, I gotta, I'm gonna have to save and I'll come back in a second here. Apologies. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Yeah, I don't know about that. Um, hopefully, I won't see that kind of lag. We'll see. No, it's still lagging. Very strange. I was not doing that uh, last time I did. I was playing for sure. All right, so I'm gonna um, go back to the stash here.
I just have a stash here. Okay. So here's why I left some um, bunch of stuff here. So maybe I don't have to go further back. Let's see if I have enough stuff here. I'm definitely hitting Y here. Okay, I think this might be a uh, issue with Okay, get another level here. Level 12. Where's the nearest Alter. There's one on level 14. Let's go back there and, and BUC test some of this stuff. Hey, good morning, Cloud. How are you doing? Um, there's a few weird things going on here. Still in voice issues. Oh, yeah. I heard you were, you were sick. Are you feeling any better? I mean, all kinds of technical difficulties tonight. Great. Like the um the fact that everything is causing my input to stop is weird too. I just because I only have one line of text, that's why. Um so I just need to change my my resolution a little bit here or my screen height. It's gonna really bother me. So I'm gonna to have to um, make that change. I wonder if we can do it without restarting. Probably not. I need like 35 rows or something here. Um, it sort of worked, but let me just restart it. I still only have one line of text though I should have a few it's not filling the full screen or if I have to re maybe it it, it grabbed my uh, terminal size when I logged in and now it's still doing the thing <laughs> Okay, there we go. That's better. Been fine. Started with a sore throat, which is passed, but just voice refuses to function. I'm sorry to hear that. All right, we'll see. At least now uh, I have the text, but um, I'm still lagging behind my stream, which is really odd. I don't know if anyone's ever seen that before. I could like move the, 
move the stream over and just play on that window. But that seems kind of odd. I don't know if it would even work. If I don't have my this uh, window focused. I'm trying to get to level 14 here. A winged gargoyle. Let's be a test of my combat readiness here. See how I do. I'm able to kill it. Didn't take very much damage, so not a problem. There's the throne here. And I guess um because there were four trolls there, I decided not to fight them. Particularly because Molnir's gonna wake them all up. Uh, speaking of which I need to put on my invisibility ring. Let's go to the we're burdened too. Let's go to back to the altar here. Um yeah, it's, there's a temple up here. It's a lawful, it's fine. Alright, I actually don't have that much stuff that isn't already BUC tested here. I can try on these amulets, there aren't. Um, why? Oh, am I blind? Yeah, yeah. It's like, why, why, is, why are things not being BUC tested? Still wearing my blindfold. All right. Yes, these are these are uncursed amulets. Let me try them on. Okay, found an amulet of guarding. Don't know what the other one is. But if we find the shield of reflection, we can switch to the amulet of guarding. Uh, do have an uncursed scroll of enchant armor, so we could use that. To make some dragon scale mail. And we have seven uncursed pollutions of water. Um, so, do not have a wand of digging, though. I'll try and teleport the Titan away, I suppose. But it could still, um, you know, summon things endlessly uh, on top of us. Did I not drop the or the bag? Why do I not know that that is? Uh... Um. Yeah, this is not this is not updating. I have to like drag the window around to make it update. Um, let me try changing that display setting back. Let's see if this helps. That's the only thing I changed. So we are burdened. I have another stash, I think, back in uh, Sokoban, is my guess. You know, let's go back up to, up to Sokoban. We're not that far right now. and I'll just figure out what we have. I, I, my memories might have another wand of digging back there and that would really be the safest way to deal with this titan just dig straight through and, and fight on the way back up all right here's the big room i think i just ran through last time i scared things with my bugle this is a quick look um if there's anything here that's well nothing that i can really see Stud leather, don't care about. Don't know what these 
other things are. Still doing it, huh? Sokoban. I think I have a stash here. I do. Yeah, no more wands of digging. I did leave my pickaxe here. Really not much here we care about, to be honest. Some extra food. We need, we need tons of food at the castle, so. Um, I do want to get unburdened if I can. Do I not have any holy water? Cursed potions of water, but I don't see any blessed potions of water. I had a uh, converted altar in Orc Town, so that would be where I could go. Yeah, I'd have to go there next to get some holy water. Like to have a bag of holding here. So what can we get rid of? So we're going to go to all the way back to Mine Town here, or Orc Town. I'm being a little bit more uh, conservative here just because I'm a tourist, not a Valkyrie. Is that two? Oh, there's a base cost three hundred scroll here still. If I already bought it or not. these gems here. We're invisible, so we should be able to throw these to the uh, unicorn. So that was a valuable one.
All right. Don't have a luck stone, right? Yeah. I thought I did get a luck stone. Oh no, I do have a luck stone. So I should, my my luck should be maxed out. Pretty sure I did max it out. Let's make some holy water. Is there a stash under here? Yeah, it looks like I had a bunch of stuff here. So I already had holy water. I just stashed it all. Yeah, so I need to come back here with a bag of holding, clearly. Um, free action, aggravate monster. No more digging though. So I did not have an extra solid junk. I have an extra digging wand. Oh, here, here we go. Here's, here, here's my other ones. All right, so yeah, I just didn't pick all this stuff up. Okay. See if we can carry this stuff. Maybe not like this. Not everything, everything. Definitely not the lodestone. So we do have a digging wand, so we'll use that to get through. I thought I had one. I think I need this undead turning at all. Just leave the rest of this stuff. Okay. We are burdened, but we can drop some stuff back at our stash. I guess I will uh, go ahead and pray. Make that holy water. Save ourselves some uh, a potion. Of course I can't. Four rings of polymorph control. I uh, don't think we need that many. prayer time out figured out here.
Let's see, do I have a uh, sleep resistance? I do. Still helpful, huh? Oh, there's a blessed scroll of enchant weapon, so let's see if we can get our Molnir enchanted up to seven right now. Yep. Great elf, we can actually sacrifice the great elf. Alright, there we go. Um check out this leather hat over here. Yeah. All right, so we're off. We, I guess we're never coming back here again. We'll uh, drop some stuff back in Sokoban, just to get unburdened. And then I think we will go make some dragon scale mail. I'm going the wrong way. can't carry anything else without being overburdened. Okay, so the plan is to get down to the castle, dig through Medusa. Might come back up and uh, deal with Medusa right away, see if we can't find a shield of reflection. Let's check out this uh, scroll shop while I'm here. And then we can get ourselves our bag of holding, um, come back to the quest. And nothing here we really care about. And then we'll deal with that Titan after we have magic magic resistance. Um, the issue with uh, fighting the Titan without magic resistance is cast some pretty nasty spells on you. And just their summoning is pretty bad, so. Quite dangerous. I'm going through food quite quickly. That's just because I'm burdened, maybe. All right, what do we drop here? I'm gonna drop drop a bunch of scrolls because we're not gonna need those until um, after the quest. I'm doing a ID scrolls, but I could just uh, quaff a couple extra healing. For uh, whoa, I had two of them. Hmm. Somehow I only took one out. bit uh, inefficient, but here we go. It's 132 HP, that's nice. Um, all right, what else are we getting rid of? I guess a bunch of scrolls.
collect all these. I do want some uh, cursed and un uh, uncursed scrolls here. I do want the scroll of earth potentially. The rest of these we can drop though. burdened um extra rings we can get rid of they're not very heavy but um i think we need 14 potions of holy water let's get rid of half of those Probably do it. I'm oh, still burdened, huh? I'm not really sure where my pickaxe is either. Now, four food rations is probably what we need. I guess I can take out these potions of unholy water. Um, <laughs> we'll need those till later, probably. And these ones of magic missile too. All right, now we're unencumbered. And hopefully we have enough stuff to get us down to... You know, I do actually want a magic mapping scroll. Take a couple because there can be mazes between the Medusa and the castle, which we don't want to have to map manually. Probably forgetting something. It's going to dip this curse scroll. We have a couple to write some cursed genocide with. I do like that the uh, wood golems now have, and uh, rope golems now drop some more interesting stuff. It used to be just a bunch of quarter stabs, but now. Anything made of wood can be dropped by a wood golem, which I think is pretty cool. I 
All right, so there's the throne here. I think I can take it. The, the trolls are going to be annoying. But with our AC and hit points, I think we're okay. Let's go ahead and see if we get a, a throne wish here. Eat this uh, red Naga corpse. No luck there. No light source. All right, so they're starting to wake up because I'm not stealthy. That's fine. I sort of want to deal with them one at a time here in the doorway. So here comes the trolls. We're, yeah, this is not a problem at all. Um, the only real issue is that the trolls will keep coming back. Oh, there's a scare monster scroll here. Interesting. My guess is we will not be able to pick it up, but if we could, that would make fighting those dragons a lot easier too. Uh, so someone has a lightning wand. There is a wand here. I have to figure out why my screen is not updating. Hopefully you're not seeing anything weird on your end. It, it looks okay on the preview. Um, No luck with the wish at all. Or just stash this stuff. Uh, ah, we were able to pick up the scare monster scroll, so. That's nice. You can use that for the fighting the dragons and getting some temporary scale mail. This throne room is cleared. So there was a stash here, no longer a stash here, but I could stash things again. Some of this stuff I deed. I think I walked past the other the general store. Maybe I didn't. Well, there's poison, magical breathing. Good stinking cloud. We did find genocide. OK. 
Okay. It's a blessed scroll of genocide too. We're still burning though. So let's drop some stuff here. Magical breathing, amulet versus poison, like most of the gold. Save some from that general store, but we also have all these gems, so. There we go. Unburdened. Nice stash is good. That's just a treasure zoo, I think. There's the general store. Let's go check that out. It's not letting me fast travel there because there's a spider web here. The nice thing about Sting is you can cut right through it. Yes, the horn could be, I think I think anything better than the bugle, really. I'm going to actually just buy these rings, to be honest. I'm going to ID them. Some more holy water or unholy water. Yeah, there's some more. Right, so there's a genocide and another one that's that is unID'd. So let's buy all those things. Do some more IDing once we get to the castle. There's a Beehive there. I don't. Don't really need. Oh, there's the. There are the dragons. Okay. So to save this scroll of scare monster and dip it in, in holy water. And now it's blessed scroll of scare monster. So we should be able to pick it back up. There is a red dragon here, which I guess um, my reflection will probably prevent the red dragon from destroying the scare monster scroll, but I'm not sure about that. Okay, so they're waking up, and I dropped the um, scare monster scroll, and I'm pretty safely fight off of here now. I'm blinded by the flash because it was... Okay, now I'm off of the Scarmonster Squirrel, I think. He's in the doorway, I think. Mm. I don't see it. So maybe it did get destroyed. So this blue dragon is going to be tricky to kill. So I don't have any additional. Um, let's use our bugle here. Get them to run away. I right, killed the blue dragon. I think blue dragon would be our ideal uh, scales to to start off with here. Get some speed. Just watch my hit points here. 
Use my bugle. Oh, you killed that blue dragon. Um, there is a set of blue dragon scales, so that's nice. And uh, the red dragon did not drop scales, but we don't. That's probably the, my least favorite scales anyway, so. The throne was here with the chest. Remove it. Take out the stuff that's unidentified here. No luck. I think we leave that stuff for now. Oh, then actually, this will help a lot too um, with my burden being burdened. So take the blue dragon scales and be nice to find a closet to so do this and I guess there's a closet over here. Particularly these trolls continually coming back. I right, lock that door. And do we have do we have two enchant armor? There's one. So we had two. I guess I only brought one one with me. I mean, take everything else off temporarily here. And then we wear the blue dragon scales. And uh, that's going to give us extrinsic speed, which would be great. And we're wearing nothing else, so we'll read the Blessed School of Enchant Armor, and that gives us plus one uh, Blue Dragon Skill Mill, drop the Mithril Coat, and uh, put the Hawaiian Shirt back on. <clears throat> yeah. A few more points of AC, we get um, Extrinsic Shock Resistance, which is great to protect our wands and rings from shocking spheres. Horn could always be a horn of plenty. Yeah, welcome Xerxia. Yeah, that um I'm not don't usually have problems with food. Um once I get to the castle, if there's huge stacks of K rations and um and there's a food storeroom there and stuff, so I'm not usually worried about about food, but uh certainly that is one of the, the horns it could be. That being said, I'm I'm kind of low on food right now. Just down to two for food rations, but we're on our way to the castle. So we're unburdened, um, and we are ready to go down and dig through Medusa to the castle. Yeah, I do have the Wanda digging. Yeah, so this is um, the Titan casting uh, a summoning spell. This is where you get surrounded and killed pretty pretty quickly. Um, so we're just going to move off the stairs and we're going to zap the Wanda digging down and fall through. All right, so this is a, a, a maze level. Um, and there are two minotaurs here, so that is dangerous. We do have a horn though, and we have the wand to sleep, so we're totally fine. Oh, I did bring magic mapping for this. And we're very close to the stairs, which is great. And now there is um, lines across my screen, so I may have to restart my computer at some point. I think you can't see it on your preview, but some very fine lines. 
Definitely seems like a graphic issue. So we have another level of mazes. There's one minotaur here. There's a chick trace. Um, so we have our second scroll of magic mapping here. And we're a little further off from the stairs. I don't have a pickaxe because I didn't bring it with me. Find a polymorph trap. Good thing I didn't step into that or else we would have turned into a blue dragon. Looks like I'm going to be using some charges of digging here. I could, I don't have teleport control. I could just teleport and see if I get closer. I don't know if that's, uh, and lots of digging are much more common, so I think I just use that first. Just do the maze legitimately here, mostly. All right, so this is a magic trap. Um, not a big deal. There we go. And looks like we have yet another level. So we were, it's a deep castle. I don't think I have any more scrolls here of magic mapping. I only brought the two. So we have to, unfortunately, explore this one. Fortunately, it's, it's a, one of the easier ones to explore. Not too bad. All right, there's a master lich. Um, so here, I think we dig down actually. Oh, he's gonna follow us, isn't it? Um, I'm gonna bless a genocide it. The question is, will it? Uh, what nastiness will it, will it kill me with a touch touch of death before I can uh, get my scroll of genocide out that's the question if i teleport it away it's going to come back let's do that though um so teleport it away pull out the blessed scroll of genocide read it get rid of all liches um definitely don't want to mess with that without magic resistance for sure so we did um Get a bunch of our stuff cursed. Anything really important? We want it digging, want it cold. The high boots. Well, eventually we are going to want to put on the levitation boots. In fact, speaking of that, I did want to um, check Medusa for the Perseus statue to see if there's a shield reflection there. Okay, let's do that because that's going to make a difference in terms of uh, what scales, dragon scales, I'm interested in here. It's not going to auto travel here because. Padded gloves. I already have gauntlets of dexterity. Those are probably just uh, leather gloves. Pick up the sea ration. Yeah. I'm gonna dig here as well. Another gray stone. Could be a touchstone. Don't think we really care at this point. Right, let's take off our invisibility wand, uh, ring here and just kill Medusa that way. There's Perseus, so we'll zap striking down here. Nothing but a sack with the food ration in it. So um, it's good to know there was, there was nothing else there. Let's go back down. Uh, 
Oh, so here's the dumpster. It's okay. All right, so we should be getting to the castle now. I'm gonna put my towel on just so we can see what the deal is right when I go through. All right, so we're on the left side. There's a gargoyle, that's not a big deal. Blue dragon, that's not a big deal either, given our uh, shock resistance. We killed all the all liches, so. Um, and there's a white dragon, blue, blue, orange, okay. There's a minotaur on this side. I really wish I did bring a pickaxe, just couldn't carry it. Uh, so we have to figure out how to get out of this maze. Probably just use our wand to digging again. Our inventory, um, weight of inventory is a lot better than it was. So there are uh, eels here. We're going to do the drawbridge game now. All right, so no A's. No B's. Okay, this might be easy. No C's. Oh, there's one D. So it's the first one is D. And there's an E. One D, one E. So it's D is the first one and E is the last one. The middle is for F and G's. All right, so we found it. D, F, 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 E. Easy enough. So we need to make sure that eel uh, runs away. So we, if we didn't lose that uh, scroll of Scare Monster, we could have used that here. using the, the horn here for two purposes, both for crushing things in the drawbridge and also for scaring away the eels. We should be perfectly safe as long as uh, I don't miss a message. Uh, if they do wrap around me, I can still scare them with a, a bugle. I do like that new feature in 3.7, where it uh, won't let you walk into the moat. Yeah, so it's not updating it again. Those are there to crush. Well, there's all of those things. There's a, a disenchanter we definitely want to crush. You know what I should do is take my invisibility ring off. Um, get them over here a little quicker.
There's a mine flare here somewhere. It's actually right there. Question the drawbridge. I wonder if it's uh, invisible. Got now. I think we can move on. We'll have to fight the soldiers in the barracks. Um, I think that's okay. Are these both peaceful? Yep, just the giant mummies. The giant mummies are annoying because they will also break break down doors. All right, we'll eat that troll. Um, I really would like to pick up some of these spell books and ID them, but if we can, we can. Genocide. So do we genocide Shocking Spheres or do we roll with Blue Dragon Scale Mill? Um, did not find a... Well, we have our Amulet of Reflection. We're likely to find a Shield of Reflection at some point on an Angel or something. So we could do Molnir, Shield of Reflection, and then we could do a Cloak of magic resistance, replace our cloak of protection. And then we could stick with the blue dragon scale mail to give us uh, shock resistance and speed. So I think mind flares would be the next thing, at least you know, immediately. Master mind flare is probably the most dangerous thing, so. Get rid of master mind flares. Let's make a note here that we Got rid of uh, Annihilated Liches and Mastermind Flare. Um, maybe we do check out the store rooms before we go over to the Wanda Wishing. These dragons are not terribly dangerous, I don't think. Particularly not the blue ones. We have a uh, Levitation Boots. Everything we don't know, it's uh, cursed or not, and then I'll pull out um, remove curse, and bless it. And read one of them. All right, and I'll put everything away. And all right, take off high boots, put on levitation boots, and it lets us go over the trap doors here. All right, again, it's gonna be a little bit tricky to kill this blue dragon, but we were able to do it, despite the fact that it doesn't take any of the Lightning damage. Potion full healing, we definitely want that. Um, let's see. I could get innate shock resistance here. Uh, because I don't think I have it intrinsic. I just have it um so let's no, let's eat the blue dragon corpse if I can. Yeah, there we go. So that gives us innate shock resistance. We do have cold resistance already. And sleep resistance. Leather, don't care. Crested helmets. Let's see if that's anything good. Conical hat, we're not a wizard. Slippery cloak. Um, ornamental cope, definitely know what that is.
if I take off cloak protection, let me just wear this. All right, so we found it's a cloak protect, a displacement. It's actually cursed, which is not great, but um, um, it's not magic resistance. Slippery cloak is oil of skin, which is situationally useful. Pick some of this food up. Columbus wafer for sure. Almost never anything here that I'm looking for. <clears throat> Do not want to spare Luckstone, really. All right, let's go find the Wanda Wishing now that we know what was here for free. Yeah, the the uh, soldiers have visored helmets, so the crested helmet's something. Um, best case, it's helm of opposite alignment. It'd save us a wish later. Actually, eh, not as good because we're neutral, but if we can carry it, it's probably still worth holding on to. Oh, level 13, nice. Maybe we'll get to level 14 without having to um, reverse genocide wraiths. Not, not here, it's gonna be another side. There it is. All right, we're gonna do some blessed ID here. Um, we need to know if this scroll here is charging, uh, or this one, uh, primarily, to know whether we need to wish for uh, charging or not. Let's see if this scroll of genocide is cursed. Let's well check out this scroll identify two spell book. Um, Check out ring. Put away some things here. Just punishment. This one is uh, taming. So we've not ID'd charging yet, unfortunately. And check out this crest helmet. Brilliance. Okay, well, it's actually not bad. We will probably want to cast spells. And slow dig digestion. Eh. Um, so we are going to need to wish for charging first. Let me double check. We found Stinking, Cloud, Punishment, Genocide, but not found Charging. So we can't write it, so we got to wish, wish for it. So we'll wish for um, two Blessed Scrolls of Charging. Um, 
So next we'll try and wish for... Can we wish for a magic marker? Or just a cloak of magic resistance. I sort of want to wish for a marker so we can ID it um, while we're IDing everything else. And then we can see how many charges we have left on the Wanda machine. So we don't rest it. Do not. So we wish for a marker. And now we can read identify. We got our full ID. So it was a three, a zero three, which is brilliant. Magic marker is only 53, which is not the best. Um, plus zero Helm of Brilliance. We could enchant that up, though. Probably worth a few enchant armor scrolls to uh, just get our attributes up and uh, have a decent Helm. Helm of Brilliance can be corroded. I guess that doesn't really matter. We'll get rid of this cloak to place displacement for magic resistance, I guess. And so cure sickness. I don't think that's one of the ones we really care about. See, so as a tourist. You can get divination, enchantment, and escape. Divination is really the, the the spells that are most useful, because then we can get magic mapping. We can get um, yeah, so magic mapping and identify are really really useful. So with that helmet brilliance, potentially we could. Um, yeah, with that Helm of Brilliance, we could, we could potentially cast those spells if we could find them, or maybe even wish for them. Is it like worth wishing for a spellbook of magic mapping? Look up spellcasting probabilities here. So if we were for level, say level 14, tourist, with, uh, say with 18 intelligence, um, take our shield off, divination is basic, yeah, I still can't cast magic mapping. Yeah, magic mapping is going to be too hard to cast, unfortunately. Because we can only get to basic with it. Identify should be fine. Identify we can cast, no no problem. Um, but that's less useful. Because we have to do the magic mapping just with a marker. That's unfortunate. Um, Was uncursed scroll of genocide. Okay. Potentially use that for mind flares or curse it. Ring of teleportation.
So marker. We need a we need a bag of holding. That's really gonna be our next wish for sure. Could poly try and polypile stuff, but uh um I think we're okay. Let's use some wishes here. We did get a zero three. Alright, so we're gonna zap and we wish for a blessed priest bag holding. Get everything we can out of our sack here. Drop everything here. Do some inventory management here quickly. All right, so the sack is empty, so we can drop that. And just this to that's holding all right blessed bag holding um Wand of Wishing. All right, so back up to 1-3 now. So Magic Resistance is next priority. So I think we do wish for that. We need one more level. I think we can curse the, I think we just curse the scroll genocide and, and get some wraith corpses for that. to three holy water got more back at the stash though just need to get rid of this uh cursed cloak of displacement all right we're wishing for a blessed fixed greased plus two hey andrew welcome um cloak of magic resistance That lets us take off. Uh, yeah, so we're gonna put that on. Let me match resistance. We just drop these, drop these other ones, and uh, take off the orcish helm. And we'll put on the helm of brilliance. I think we'll actually chant that up a little bit too. How much uh, do we have for scrolls here? Because we're a little bit low on scrolls. Could uh, bless three of them. We could go back to our stash anyway. Actually, I don't think I brought unholy water with me, did I? No, so I have to go back to the stash to do that anyway. All right, so let's put the wand of wishing into the bag of holding so I don't lose it accidentally. And uh, so there's that titan to deal with. It's still going to be a pain in the butt with all the summoning, but less dangerous because we have magic resistance. Um, so not so worried about it. Destroying our armor or things like that, as long as we don't get uh, 
overwhelmed by it. AC's gone down by a point overall, but um, we're still good to go here. And nurse dancing or anything. Rage is decent, actually. It could be better, but um, I don't think we have enough magic marker charges and wishes right now to to do nurse dancing. Maybe if we find another squirrel of genocide around. Maybe what I should do is I should just name this. Um, it's a normal helmet. Because if we do find a helmet that we haven't ID'd, that could be opposite alignment, which would be useful. Another ring of invisibility. All right, let's get out of here. I do actually kind of want to kill all those soldiers for food, but I guess we do that when we come back up. So we have a decent amount of food right now. Um, this paralisk is going to... So we have fire resistance, so we're fine. Actually, we have reflection, so we're totally fine. All right. Um, right here we are. Need to put on the levitation boots here. The nice thing with the levitation boots is they can't get destroyed by the uh, elect electric eels. Um, of course, we have blue blue dragon scale mail, so we're not worried about that, regardless. But um, uh, it says actual vampire, huh? I guess we have some magic cancellation. Um, and if we have a horn to deal with the electric eels. And, and they're not as dangerous regardless because we don't destroy our stuff. Ooh, a wraith. If we can get that wraith um, over dry land here, maybe it'll drop a corpse. That would be actually huge to get from level 13 to level 14. Let's see, it'll fly over here. Should I take my invisibility ring off to make it come closer. Ah, no corpse. I don't think the Medusa level counts as a graveyard. Castle does. And the Valley of the Dead does. There's the Electric Eel. They're also going to be annoying because they don't take the extra damage from uh, Molnir. I should just... No, I don't want to break my wand to sleep. I want to adjust my bugle to H. We're just gonna scare these eels off with our horn, not deal with them. The frost giant has a wand of undead turning. That's actually pretty annoying. Get our lizard corpse back here. So, how are we dealing with this? Titan, I think we're just hitting it till it dies. And uh, scaring things it summons with our bugle. And hopefully that just works. Um, if I kill these gremlins before they start reproducing endlessly. There's the, there's the Titan. All right. 
Lightning seems does seem to be hurting it, so that's good. They're not immune to it. Oh, he did kill it. Uh, it just summoned a small army of things. Not the end of the world here. And uh, they're not immune largely. So I adjust my unicorn horn back to where it should go here. There's a cockatrice corpse there. If we needed it. Pretty sure reduced to this layer is not a graveyard floor. Yeah, I didn't think it was either. Just got just got a little bit unlucky there. Not getting a corpse from that. Wraith. Alright, so we made it through. Do I not have my towel in the right place either? I don't. All right, just keep my eye out for wraith, wraiths here as we make our back up to the stash. Is that a, uh, a nurse? It is. I could just do like a little bit. Well, no, I don't want to do nurse dancing on a teleport level. Should um, delete some potions and scrolls, blank some scrolls while I'm at it. Do I have a see invisible? Sure, I do. No, I can see invisible. Okay. I wonder if I ate a, um, no, I didn't, I haven't eaten a stalker corpse yet. Cause I can become uninvisible. I take off my ring. That's about it. All right, here's the actual stash. Wasn't very much stuff there. Just dropped a few things, I think. Uh, a huge barracks here. I don't think I need anything from the barracks. I have gloves. I have a bugle. I'll probably ignore that. I 
Oh, there's a wraith here. There you go. Ah, uh, not lucky again. So one more level here to do the quest, so. So the rest of my stash is in Sokoban. So we'll go back there for the last time. And then we'll be done. Do I want to clear this? I don't really want to clear this level. I don't know. I could kill some things. I don't think it's that dangerous anymore. I'm pretty sure it's not dangerous, actually. We do want to just clear it. Stay away from the green J there. Being invisible really helps in rooms like this. Uh, things tend to swarm you a little bit less. See if there's anything here that uh, we're missing out on. Another gauntlet, gauntlets of uh, dexterity there. I really wish uh, rings were more useful. Kind of a fun idea, but I think it's kind of hard to use in anything. They actually probably could be used in a big room like this. Um, so they need a big arc. It's a square amulet. Kind of interested in what that might be. I think we'll start picking up spell books. I'm, I've missed a couple, or, or I've left a couple, couple behind because. Of weight issues. But now they have a blessed bag of holding, should be all set. All right. I should grab a light source too at some point and find a lamp. There's our stash. Need our pickaxe now. Um, so we do pick up all this stuff.
All right, so we're unburdened. It's good. Put away some of these wands and things. I think that's everything. I don't think we need to come back here ever again. So that stash is done. Um, all right, so XP 13. So I guess we are... Um, take out a three of the Uncursed Scroll of Genocide here. We'll take out one potion of Unholy Water. Make a Cursed Scroll of Genocide. And. I don't scare monster or anything. I guess we scare, can, can scare wraiths with a. a um, A horn, though. This room is actually not the best. Let's find a better room to, to do that in. I sort of like to lock them in, but not have a door, uh, a staircase for them to escape in. Was that a paper golem? Yeah, we sure want those scrolls. by the altar, actually. So there's a blessed spell book, so we'll read that. Visibility. That is an escape spell, which we can actually learn, but it's not a very useful spell. So we'll just leave that. All right. Um, All my things got renamed. Um, all right, so now we should be able to. It's not actually the right size room, is it? We want to have spaces all around us.
I'm gonna do it right here. I got five of them. Make them flee and then uh, start to kill them. I right, got to level 14, so it was successful. Uh, lost a level. Up to 15 again. And 16. There we go. Very successful. There's one more over there, so we might as well. I oh, did it hit a polymorph trap. It's gone. I think I might have hit a polymorph trap. No longer a wraith, so we're not interested. We do need to find the um, portal. Yeah, there's a polymorph trap. There's the magic portal, okay. So we're ready to do the quest pretty much. Um, I tell you what, I don't normally do this, but I think I'm gonna take a quick break. Um, and I'll be back and do, do the quest afterward. Um, so I'll be right back. And I'm gonna see if I can figure out what's going on with my screen here while I do that as well. Um, in any case, I'll be right back in, in about five minutes. So thanks a lot for hanging out and I hope to uh, see you when I get back.
Okay, I'm back. Thanks for your patience. So we're going to go through uh, and into the tourist quest, which I'm actually going to look up just because I haven't done it in a while. All right, this is the one. So the uh, Master of Thieves is much tougher now than they were before, which is interesting. It's got uh, high magic resistance, though, so we can't put them to sleep anymore. They increased it. Be a little careful fighting him. All right, let's go give this a try. You breathe a sigh of relief as you find yourself back in the familiar surroundings of Ankh Morpork. You quickly notice that things do not appear the way they did when you left. The town is dark and quiet. There are no sounds coming from behind the town walls and no campfires burning in the fields. As a matter of fact, you do not you do not see any movement in the fields at all, and the crops seem as though they have been untended for many weeks. There's a bunch of centaurs and uh, giant spiders here. I uh, died once. Ooh. Be careful there, almost rocked into the water. I always forget about being stunned when you go through a portal. I died in the tourist uh, quest before to poison, because I didn't have poison resistance. It's like a very promising run other than that. I just didn't manage to get poison resistance. Uh, and eventually just died. Is that a towel? It's clearly it's a towel, yeah. We already have a towel. These are uh, peaceful? Yeah, peaceful watchmen. I was looking at one of the watchmen and wondering why I wasn't moving. Is a graveyard up there? Doesn't really seem to matter. Why is... Um, my lizard corpse probably got... left behind or something. I don't know why. The uh, graveyard just woke up. I don't really need to clear this, so I was going to check out that ring though. So something good. Okay, so these are, um, that's solid stone, okay. That's also confusing me. Is 
Is it really you, Disperse? I had given up hope for your return. As you can see, we are desperately in need of your talents. Someone must defeat the Master of Thieves if our town is to become what it once was. Let me see if you're ready to be that someone. You have indeed proven yourself a worthy tourist, Disperse. But now, your kinfolk and I must ask you to put aside your travels and help us in our time of need. After you left us, we elected a new mayor, the Master of Thieves. He proved to be a most heinous and vile creature. Soon after taking office, he absconded with the Platinum Yendorian Express card and fled town, leaving behind his henchmen to rule over us. In order for us to regain control of our own, we must enter the Thieves' Guild Hall and recover the Platinum Yendorian Express card. Do not be distracted on your quest. If you do not return quickly, I fear that all will be lost. Let us both pray now that the Lady will guide you and keep you safe. There's a, there is a um, throne here. Which we can use to try and ID some stuff. Some charisma. All right, so we have some. Looks like sort of gnomish mines type levels here. Oh, detect monsters. That's interesting. Do I not have that spell? I do ends divination. I was thinking if I want to try and learn divination spells, I can cast invisibility. Particularly because I have the Helm of Brilliance. I never did enchant that Helm of Brilliance, actually. Take off my shield and cast it pretty well. Check monsters at skilled or better is a pretty good spell, actually. Um, although we can't get it at skilled. Yeah, it's, it's really not a very good spell. But if you can get it skilled divination, then it works like a blessed tech monster potion, which is really good. There's let that one be forgotten oil lamp if I ID'd have I ID'd oil lamps looks like I haven't ID'd any lamps let's assume that's an oil lamp I think it's archaeologists that can get skilled in Divination makes the, the late game a lot of fun. So I, is there any spells I'm really looking for then? I, mean, I could cast spells with my loadout, but I think I'm probably just not going to worry about it. Escape spells. Any good escape spells? Teleport, levitation, invisibility, haste, jumping. I don't know. I think I'm probably just going to not worry about spellcasting this game.
Ah, I was able to pick up that scroll monster. Um, Another scroll of genocide, nice. There we go. Finally. Only your faith in the lady keeps you from trembling. You see the handiwork of the Master of Thieves henchlings everywhere. Alright, so this is like a town, right? I seem to remember this from Um. We ascended a tourist in that hackathon first, right? So that was uh, the last time I saw someone ascend a tourist. Bunch, bunch of uh, soldiers here in a barracks. Lightning, there's some wraiths. That must be a graveyard level here. So I could actually use, potentially lure those Rates up the uh, previous level. Try to get some more levels. I do want these K rations, actually. I'm not going to put that wand, unidentified wand, to my bag of holding. Oh, it's a wand of lightning. Okay. That I can put in. Found a one of death. That's nice. Actually, I can use that to kill the. Uh, <laughs> we'll make it make our make the master of thieves really easy. I do not believe they wear cloak of magic resistance or anything. So that will be very nice. Maybe do a little bit of ID and actually just gonna lock them in there. Don't worry about that. So it's a bunch of shops. We will check them out because I do want to see if there's anything worth identifying here. Hmm, chant armor, we probably just want to buy that. Is there a uh, temple here too? There might be. Actually, I think we want a price ID. At this point, we'll just ID stuff with our blessed scrolls of ident identify. Luxy Dream was piloting the tourist through this part, so it was very quick. Did not did not fully explore this level, if I recall correctly. Oh, there's traps inside the um, shop. Apron. So eat um, sea ration here. You have a pet giant spider. 
nothing here really. Yeah, nothing here. There's the downstairs. Actually, let's check because sometimes, yeah. Sometimes that could be like a mimic. Nice. These enchant armor scrolls would be good. Can actually use them. Look at that. This is like a zoo, I guess. A vault. Just a bunch of um, spiders and centaurs. Oh, I think I was going to say I woke up all the uh, soldiers, but they already woke up. There's a bunch of stuff here, actually. Is that a marker? Nice. There's some really good stuff here. Probably was another barracks. Let's uh, not put this curved wand in. Wand in. Let's have a wand of polymorph. That'd be another way to deal with Master of Thieves. Just polymorph into something and less dangerous. Whoa. It's a lot of gold. that curse it is it that way another scroll of genocide is there uh, must be a secret door here huh
All right. Two Russians here. I think I'm gonna do a try and do another full ID here once I've picked up a bunch more stuff. Ooh, what? <laughs> nice. We just found a floor Wanda wishing. <laughs> That's not guaranteed, I don't think. Okay. So this went to all of a sudden just went up a whole level in in uh in power start to be able to wish for some stuff that is fun to wish for not just stuff that we absolutely need so i think that's pretty much fully explored so let's get unburdened Probably, um, to where there's no temple here. So there's too much to ask for. Actually, let's check. It looks like there's a door over here I didn't check out. Another lamp. I'm just going to call this lamp A. All right, so that's also lamp A. So uh, very likely both oil lamps. That's, a, that's all been explored. Let's get to the stairs and I'll do a quick price, uh, not price ID, and I'll try and get a full, full ID here. Anything which I care about. might do some enchanting while I'm here too, because I have so many enchant armor scrolls. This is my inventory, unfortunately. I'm not wearing my shield, I guess, because I was testing my spellcasting. Forgot to put it back on. those um, rings for sure so I don't really care about um, all these wands all right should we get enough and we got a full ID nice 
Another zero three Wanda wishing. Beautiful. So I think we should um, go ahead and get a shield of reflection and um, aim of life saving because just in case something goes south, having life saving is huge. Something really interesting in terms of rings. Um, Wanda Death only has one charge on it, but can't complain too much. We'll charge it with the uh, Platinum Endurian card, charge card. And yeah, it is an oil lamp, oil lamp so that does not surprise me. Okay, so let's go ahead and get ourselves a shield of reflection here and an aim of the life saving. Should use the other wand first, I guess. Just use that one up and this one, the full one, will put away for now. So two wishes. Um, and we're going to wish for a plus two. Blessed plus two shield of reflection. Uh, take off the elven shield. Wear that. And um, then we can take off the shield, the amulet reflection, and we'll go ahead and wish for a blessed amulet of life saving. Put that on. And now we're a lot safer than we were. Um, yeah, so life saving's huge. And we have how many? We have five enchant armors. So take that out. Take out one potion of holy water. Bless them. I start enchanting up my helm and stuff. Let's um, lock ourselves in here. Take off everything else and uh, start enchanting our Hamel Brilliance. Plus three, plus five. Good. Take that off. Um, wear the Hawaiian shirt. We can enchant that up. Done. Um, let's wear the Cloak of Magic Resistance, enchant that. Wow, we're getting really lucky with these enchants. That's the third plus three that we got. Um, I guess we'll do the silver shield as well. I right, only got two that time. So, but we're still like completely stacked now. Um, all right, negative 35 AC. Uh, cannot complain. So doing very well here. Um, anything else we want to do? Not that I can think of. Let's go ahead and finish this quest. Oh, that wanted teleportation I would like, but hard to get it with any charges left in it. Another, um, looks like another standard sort of mines-ish level here. We do have a a lamp, lamp, or, uh, lamp though, so make it easier to explore. Captain wields a longsword, so no silver saber. Not that we're going to use a silver saber. Um, we are going to be a bit, I guess, um, angels are immune to lightning, so it's not very good on the astral plane. I usually do not fight things in melee in the astral plane anyway, so maybe with the exception of death. 
who I think does take damage from lightning, so. I want that wand of fire too. Well, there is a silver saber. But yeah, again, I I think we're uh, not gonna do dual, dual wielding either. We're set with our plus four polished silver shield here. And I think we're gonna keep our blue dragon scale mail uh, for the speed and the shock resistance. Let's see these Q rations. Still burdened though, huh? Any way to get unburdened is a question. Well, probably dropping some of these 12 food rations would help. Um, and let's get rid of a bunch of these gems too. Do not need to have these gems. In fact, I'll turn that off in my auto pickup. Still burdened. I have four points of protection. I wonder if I need any more gold. Spare unicorn horn. I could definitely polypile these amulets and stuff like that. I just have tons of scrolls of potions, I think. So much food. Get rid of all these food rations. There we go. I consider stashing stuff or picking stuff up when I get back, but for now at least we're unburdened. Pine wand. I think that's uh, cancellation. That's actually pretty useful. Can blank a bunch of stuff here. Um, scrolls of light. Fuse monster. Create monster. some uh, more holy water here. I think it'll probably be fine with my spell for confusion, so I don't think I need to keep booze or confusion. I'm not sure I can cancel fruit juice, though.
Probably good enough. All right. Make sure we don't put that cancellation in our bag of holding. All right, so no, nothing yet. What's this? There's a Titan here. Maybe you can avoid it. Pretty sure we can kill it, but uh, summoners can be pretty annoying. All right, here we go. So here we are. Um, looks like there's some more shops here, actually. Some prisoners guarded by Keystone Cops. A bunch of sort of zoos, I guess. A graveyard. All right. We're going to check out these shops, see if there's anything worth picking up here. So traps inside of stores. <laughs> it's interesting. I guess we could buy these rings. Oh, I, don't, I might have... Uh, did I bring enough money? I think I do. One more shot. Enchant armor. close here. Probably don't need to clear this place. But I'm sort of interested. Did want to check out the shops for sure. Drum. potions and scrolls um, yeah 30 scrolls and uh, 20 potions of holy water should be, 
should be enough. A little careful here, but I think we're fine. Should not pick up this uh, potion of water. A chameleon, okay. A bunch of keystone cops in here. Normally, uh, if you're not playing a tourist, the only way you can get keystone cops is if you steal something. There was a challenge in the November NetHack tournament where um, you're supposed to kill every letter, letter of the alphabet, capital and lowercase. So, of course, K, K's were a difficult one. So the Master of Thieves is up there. And we have our Wand of Death out. I think that's what we'll use for this. We could try and kill it, kill him in melee. If we I guess if we start getting low on HP, that's when we'll try the Wand of Death. If it looks like we're not gonna be able to kill it, kill him in melee. Oh, there's a cockatrice here too. Drops a corpse, then maybe we just go that way. It did. Of course it's gonna burden us. I'm just gonna take out uh, 18 K rations here and drop them. We'll pick them up on the way back out. Double checking we're wearing gauntlet dexterity. We're not going to wield it till we get right next to him because um, I'm not sure what the deal is with traps here. And let us go right up to him. Huh. Didn't work, huh? Huh. Are they immune to cockatrice corpses now? Maybe he is. Hmm. Guess you can't just turn him to stone. Let's try the wand. Uh, wanted. Well, let's try Molnir, and then if that doesn't work, we'll use the wand of death. We have to get back to um, get to the stairs, though. I don't want to take these Russians with me, but. Actually, jungle boots. If they're decent. Ah, oh, nice. Yeah, I'm not too concerned about the Master of Thieves' uh, melee damage here. It does not seem to be doing much to me. Hmm. 
if I uh, teleport, maybe I'll get back. It's basically doing no damage to me. My AC is very, very low. I right, got to the stairs. Oh, did he read a cursed scroll of teleportation? I think he did. He level teleported her. That's really annoying. Presumably he's still somewhere in the same branch. Oh, okay, there he is. You turn in the direction of the Master of Thieves. As his earthly body begins to vanish before your eyes, you hear him curse. You shall never be rid of me, Disperse. I will find you wherever you go and regain what is right, rightly mine. Here we killed him. My, where in my uh, towel? I am. Right, there's the Silver Bell and the... Yandorian Express card. As you pick up the Platinum Yandorian Express card, you feel a great weight has been lifted from your shoulders. Your only thoughts are to quickly return and find Two Flower. leave this stuff behind. I think we have enough K rations to last or last us for the rest of the game. I do want the one in teleportation. It's probably empty, but hmm, let's not put the cancellation in there. Another ring to identify. All right. As two, two Flower detects the presence of the Platinum Yandurian Express card, he almost smiles for the first time in many a full moon. As he looks up from the Platinum Yandurian Express, Express card, he says, you recovered the Platinum Yandurian Express card. You are its owner now, but not its master. Let it work with you as you continue your journey. With its help and the lady to guide you on the neutral path, you may yet recover the amulet of Yandor. All right. The quest is done. So we are ready to go to the Valley of the Dead next. Um, do a little bit of inventory management first, so we can't get ourselves unburdened here. I mean, we are on burden, but utilize what we have a little better. Let's leave all these behind here. All right, do another round of IDing. Then maybe do a little polypiling, see if we can get it some extra amulets of life saving.
think I have enough uh, scrolls to polypile some as well. I have 30, which would be way, way more than enough. Let's polypile some of these. more rings to ID and a bunch of rings we can uh, polypile as well Full ID, which is nice. Any good rings? Conflict. Did, did, did we have conflict? So that's really nice. This is a decent place to polypile, actually. I can find, yeah, right here. Potions here. I don't know if, do unlabeled scrolls ever polymorph into something else? I might just always polymorph into unlabeled. Let me give it a try. rings here. All right, let's give this a try. Another amulet guardian engagement ring. Should probably turn off uh, how to pick up here.
Magic mapping is useful. We have two clay rings. We can probably morph one of them. Spherical amulets. It's not life saving. So I think we can probably just go ahead and. What did we already have? Reaction we already have. Let me double check. What do we do? Eye rearing, we'll check that out. I guess we'll take enchant timer, although we're kind of running out of stuff to enchant. We can get rid of here. It's an extra invisibility. Oh, scroll of genocide, nice. Another scroll of uh, ring conflict. Oh, scroll of charging. Nice. Although we have the Platinum Endorian Express card, so maybe charging is less useful. We will need uh, cold detection. And there's our first amulet life saving. That's really what we we're trying to get here. So we're trying to get we already have conflict and free action. I don't really think we need anything else, to be honest. Take the potion of extra healing. That's it for poly polypiling. Um, one more charge here. get another full ID here. <clears throat> Regeneration is good. That's it. Um, so polymorph and polymorph control, if we want to do some of that. And then regeneration and conflict and free action are very useful.
All right. Um, unburdened. My other thing would be to Right, there's a temple right here, so let's go ahead and PC test things. monster scroll I pick it by dropping on the altar I always do that there's a blessed potion of extra healing we'll quaff that right now 168 the jungle boots are uncursed also a blessed full healing I think we'll quaff that too Message as we can jump. So it's jumping boots, pretty sure. Um, yep. I mean, we have. Um, we're very fast from the blue dragon scale mail, and combine combine that with jumping. It's actually a pretty good combination for getting through the astral plane quickly. So, oh, I should have ID'd as the, uh, how many charges the magic marker has. I have 10 Unker Skulls to identify, so easy enough to identify stuff. And we also have this, um, three more enchant armor. I guess we enchant the jumping boots and our blue dragon scale now. There's a, uh, see there's a, yeah, closet right here. All right. Um, all right, plus three, blessed plus three. And, um, Plus four. All right. This is uh, more prepared than I've been for the end game in a long time. Negative 40. I haven't hit that in a long time. All right. I'm going to just ID a bunch of wands too, if I can here. There we go, full ID. Oh, that was a 94 magic marker I found on the ground. Wow. That's fantastic. So we're we're stacked here. Um, there were th actually three charges on that wand teleportation too. So I'm very happy. An extra blessed amulet of life saving. All right. I mean, totally ready for the end game. So I'm just going to head down to
Let's head down to the uh, Valley of the Dead. That's the next step here. Take that lizard corpse. I don't think I have a spare, so. actually funny the um now i think of it the tourist that we ascended during the hackathon also had blue dragon scale i didn't mean to uh do the exact same thing here but uh we just happened to We just go through this hole here. There's an Asgul nearby. Oh, I guess the Platinum Enduring Express card gives us ESP. That's nice. I do have a uh, pickaxe, right? Can't take it out without getting encumbered, though, so I have to fix that. Probably mean uh, getting rid of some potions or food or something. Wands, I'm not really know. Call these gremlins. I drop all the gems here. They're actually, I think they're super light. Like they weigh one each or something, but um, be great to be able to. I'll just uh, take out like half of these K rations. All right, that worked. I'll just annotate it food, so when I'm coming back up, I can pick it up. More enchant armor, but there's nothing to enchant. I guess I can enchant the blue dragon scale mail one more time, but I'm not going to worry, worry about it. All right, and down we go. Here we are in the Valley of the Dead. I'm actually going to stop here. Uh, thanks a lot for hanging out tonight. We're going to attempt to ascend next Wednesday. We're totally ready for it. Um, Overprepared, if anything. So, you know, uh, as long as we don't make any really stupid mistakes, we should be uh, ascending next Wednesday, same time. And hope to see you then. Thanks a lot for hanging out. And have a great night.